Have you ever dreamt of designing your own home and you didn't wanna pay for the contractor or the architect, but you wanted to pick out your granite, your flooring, your countertops? Well, I have three new home communities in Fairfield that we can take a look at and see if this one's right for you. So I'm so excited to show you the locations of these three communities. Here is the Enclave at Cordelia. And as you can see here, it's very close to the 680, 80 interchange and the 12. Um, it's very close to Rodriguez High School. Um, it's also close to a lot of elementary schools and Green Valley Middle School. Um, it's also very close to a Safeway. I find it very centrally located. And if you're looking to um, commute, I, this is an ideal place um, to commute from. If you're looking that to be close to Travis Air Force Base, um, there is some shopping around it, but it is a little bit further out. Um, they do have a, a great community there and it is great for um, people who are veterans and uh, wanna work close to the base. And then you have One Lake, and this is a great community too. It is very close to Monte Verde, but um, this community offers a huge lake, a boat, uh, you can paddleboard, take little boats out, um, not ski boats, but just little paddle boats. Um, they're going to have a library. They have Journey's Coffee there. They're trying to make it a community where everyone will live and um, stay at the property or stay at, in the community. Um, it's a great location. There's lots of homes there, um, different style homes as well, which we will get into later. Here's a breakdown of all three of them, uh, the summary of all the three new construction homes in Fairfield. Again, you have the Enclave at... Uh, Cordelia, and you've got four to five bedrooms, two and a half bath, three and a half bath, um, and it continues through. This does have a little bit of a smaller square footage, um, which is nice to 3,400 square feet, which is a, is a fairly nice size home. Lots do vary. Um, the price range is a little bit higher than you'll find than the Monte Verde and the One Lake. Um, this is due usually to the fact of the location and where um, the access to shopping and schools and so forth. Um, these are base prices for these homes. This does not include the upgrades for these homes. Uh, you can see Monte Verde does have smaller homes. They don't have as many homes to choose from. They have about two plans that you get to choose from and it's a little bit smaller, 2,000 square feet to 2,400 square feet. And then one lake, um, I'll show you later, it does have three different kinds of homes within the community that's available for sale right now. And they range from 2,300 to 3,500 square feet. Here are the Enclave homes in Cordelia. Um, the first picture, it shows you the model homes. You can go look at the model homes. But like I suggest, um, you bring a realtor with you because the realtor works for you as the buying agent inside the sales office works for the builder. Um, and if you we scroll down here, we can see the different style homes that they have available right now. Um, they do have a single story, which is a big deal for some people. Uh, they don't want the two-story home. I know they have one right now that's on, I think, about a 10,000 to 12,000 square foot lot, which is actually a really big lot for a single story home. Um, as we scroll down, we can take a look at the site plan. And here you can see that they have the homeowners have already moved into a lot of the homes. And they've been building for several years now. Uh, you can tell where the model homes are right when you drive into the community. And they have the sold homes here with the red. And that's just I knew that they've sold and they haven't closed yet. The homeowners haven't moved in yet. Uh, the available homes they have right now, um, it looks like they have a five bedroom, three bathroom. Um, what's kind of neat that it does show you that they have a move-in ready home, which is down here on this corner lot. Um, that just means that this home is ready for someone. They've built it. Um, they've done whatever upgrades they've decided to do with it. And sometimes you can get a better price when uh, they have a home that's sitting there. Here I want to show you some images of what the home looks like. Um, here's your entryway. 
stairs, sitting area, you see the kitchen, living area. But I wanna point something out. Um, you see the flooring here, the cabinets, the tiles in the back, the stainless steel appliances. Um, these are all upgrades in a home. Um, you do have to pay extra for them. They will have stainless steel appliances, but some have better um, different packages. They have beginner packages, middle packages, and so forth. Um, so that all increases the price of the home, and they do have a design center that you get to go to where you get to pick all of this. Typically, you'll find um, white tile, um, just basic flooring, if you choose, um, to not upgrade your home. But they are just showing you in the models that this is all something that you can have. Now, I don't know all the upgrades that they did put into this home, um, but when we do go to the community, we can ask and they have a whole sheet of what has been upgraded, what is standard, and then you can kind of compare. So here are the Monte Verde homes um, located near Travis Air Force Base. And these are great homes for service members um, or someone looking for a great price on a home or a home that ha offers lots of rooms. Um, some of the floor plans offer up to six bedrooms, and I'll show you on one of the plans where they can do that. Uh, that um, The flooring has been nice, the, the countertops, the cabinets, they've got lighting. I do want to take you down to the floor plans. We have uh, one through four, and I'm going to show you the fourth floor plan right here. Um, some of these homes are actually ready to move in and they've upgraded it to where they feel that the buyer would um, like it. If you take a look, they've got nice cabinets, tile flooring, granite countertops. Uh, if we take a look at the um, carpet throughout is standard. Usually if you want to have tile throughout the home, that is an upgrade. If we go to the bathroom right here, you'll see that the top is standard. Um, they did not upgrade it, but they did upgrade. It looks like the cabinetry, uh, you have tile flooring. So here I want to take a look at the floor plan for you, where I was saying that you can have lots of bedrooms here. You can take a look. This is on the second floor that your loft can be changed into a sixth bedroom. And this is what it looks like right here. But you can only do this at the beginning stages of building your home. Once the home is already built out, they can't change it. So I feel like I saved the best for last. This is a master plan community, One Lake, and they offer so much. They're trying to make a whole community within this community. Um, there's biking and riding and hiking. There's a sports complex where you can go swimming and work out. There's a barbecue area, amphitheater. Um, they're offering a future retail area, which is about 10,000 square feet. And as you can see on this first page, we've got Journey's Coffee as soon as you come into the community. On the left side, you have the Grove where they have fruit trees and uh, they're making gardens for kids to go to. It's, it's the new all-inclusive uh, where you can get everything at uh, so the kids feel part of a community or the families feel part of a community. These are some of the homes that are being sold by TriPoint Homes. Uh, we have uh, Shimmer at One Lake. We have Splash at One Lake. We also have Glisten at One Lake. Glisten is coming soon. It's one of the bigger homes that they'll be selling. So I hope you were able to get a good understanding of the location of these new home builds in Fairfield. I do not represent the builder, um, but I do suggest if you are gonna go take a look at any of these homes that you take a realtor with you. The realtor works for you, whereas the sales agent works for the builder. Please like or subscribe if you're interested in seeing any of my future videos.